We found out that these trees right here, the Palo Verde trees, have edible beans inside. So these trees right here, with their edible beans, the Palo Verde tree, has got these beans on them. And if you find good ones, they're edible. You just pick them off, and then you've got to, after you get them picked off, you've got to peel this little bean. So you just open them up, and they've got beautiful beans inside. And that's the part you want to eat. They got anywhere between, this one had three, they got anywhere between one and four beans inside of each pod. And you just pop them in your mouth, and they're fantastic. They taste like little enamamis, but they're real sweet, and they're real delicious, and the kids love them. So we're going to pick a whole bunch of these and uh, peel them up and probably eat them for dinner. The tree we have all the way over there by the two chickens is edible, so we're going to crack the beans and then make that mama some dinner with them. Okay, what do we do? Um, so wait, wait, let me get a good one because that one was it. So you crack it like this, and then you get the top open like this, and then you get the good beans out. Let me see it. And then these are what the beans look like. And, these. and then what? And then you put a bit of scrap bean and put it in here, and then you get a new one. We are cracking Palo Verde beans. Palo Verde beans. Let me see. What are we gonna do with them? We're Eat gonna them. kick them. We're gonna cook, cook them, and maybe use them for dinner tonight. You like them? Yeah. They taste good. Yeah. Make the sure. outside doesn't taste good though. The outside doesn't taste good. So we're peeling the outside off. And then there are beans that you peel. Peel the outside of the bean, and then you snack on the inside of the bean. Now the Palo Verde tree is a native tree to Arizona. And I'm standing here inside of our oasis by the pond, what, what it's going to be a pond anyway. Or was a pond, ain't going to be a pond. And now it's just on my property, just growing wild here. I can see there's two big ones here. There's three there, so that's five. One in the backyard, six. That big one, seven. That's one there, eight. There's one down by the fence there, nine. Uh, one inside the fence, ten, eleven. 12, 13, 14 of them just standing here looking around and I'm probably missing some. Oh, there's one over there on the other side of the fence. 15 just standing here. So I've probably got a bunch more back towards the, the ditch back there. There's probably a bunch more Palo Verde trees. They're just growing wild. I probably got 30 or 40 of these things on my property. And here in the springtime, it's May, they're just loaded. You just pick them, peel them, and eat them.